o'clock in the morning. Um, it's raining. So I'm currently dragging my feet. I'm getting packed up for the morning. I'm eating muffin in my tent. And we could either have gone seven miles or 22 miles today to get to a road crossing. We decided that we didn't want to go 22 miles because we are now really in Rock, Sylvania, where the flat terrain that looks like this on the page is actually all rocks. So we're going to be kind to our knees and kind of Nero and then zero and then get back on and start banging out big miles again. But yeah, for today, I am enjoying knowing that later on I can dry my tent out. I have a real bed, I have a shower, and thank God we're doing laundry today because it's been a week and we smell horrible. So, very excited for this. Also, it's cold this morning. Well, I'm cold, but this is me every morning. So, you know, I'm in a jacket. I had my long sleeve on earlier because I'm like, oh, it's pouring. I'm gonna have to wear my jacket anyway, so. Yep, let's just look on those wet rocks. That'll be slippery now that it's pouring rain again. Well, it downpoured while we were trying to put our tents away. So my butt soaked because everything was wet when we put our tents away. My tent is so heavy and now it's still downpouring. And my GoPro's being finicky, so I'm trying to keep my phone under my umbrella because it's pouring. Today is going to be a very wet day. Well, we made it to the parking area where MCM is going to pick us up and it's next to this really pretty river. This is very nice. And we're over an hour early for a pickup. So MC is gonna set up his 10 footprint and his rain fly and we're gonna sit under there like hiker trash um, under an awning and wait for her to come. It's gonna be great. We're very wet, very wet. MC lovingly set up his rain fly for us. Three to fit in a one person rain fly. I have the smallest tent of the three of us. <laughs> but we're out of the rain, so it's a good idea. And now we're gonna have some quality family bonding time sitting in this tiny tent. Indeed. <laughs> Well, we made it to MCA's house with the Mountain Crusher's aunt, uh, Diane. She's amazing and she's a great cook. She fed me as soon as I got here because the guy has stopped at Sheets on the way back. Um, and I was too tired, so I slept in the car. <laughs> so we are, um, we're at MCA's house and it's beautiful here and uh, her dogs are super, super sweet and friendly, and I have gotten all the puppy snuggles today, and it's been amazing. Uh, literally, because uh, one of the dogs is actually a puppy, and it's very energetic and sweet, and reminds me of my dog. So, yeah, it was a really nice evening. It was nice to be inside, not getting rained on, but it's it's been one of those evening so for me that I've been thinking a lot I don't do very good sitting still especially off trail so emotionally it's been a hard night for me but I'm grateful that the guys are here as they always are to help me figure out how to laugh through things and enjoy every minute of this trip also uh, tomorrow is Curtis's birthday, so I won't get to be there with him, but we've got a FaceTime call planned so that I can be there when I can't be there. Pennsylvania is a little bit far from home for me, so I've been trying to get some rest, um, but I just wanted to say thank you, MCA and um, Eric, I think is MC's uncle, 
um, for hosting us at your home. And uh, thank you, Ben, for letting us shake down your pack. Uh, MC's cousin Ben uh, from Philly is going to be joining us for a few days on trail uh, next week. So that'll be a lot of fun. He let us shake down his pack tonight. So that was that was a good time. It's fun. Um, the AT is MC's first backpacking trip. And uh, it's fun to see how much he's learned that now he can help others with. So, yeah. But tomorrow's is a much needed zero day after the week we've had um and we did laundry for the first time in eight days today and i'm so happy and mc from mcm brought me loaner clothes so yeah it's we feel like real humans again so it's good good night everyone